In this video, I'm going to teach you how to change your concept of yourself and shift your identity using memorization of feeling states because as we know, feeling is the secret and also you don't get what you want, you get who you are. So the key to this and in manifesting your dream life is to create a different identity, to change your concept of yourself into the person that already has everything that you desire. Because essentially everything in your life is the way that it is because of your current concept of yourself, your current identity. And the reason it is the way that it is right now, your current concept of self is what it is, is because you have memorized a certain set of feeling states that are now putting you in the world that you are now living in. So if your world right now isn't the way that you want it to be, that things aren't going the way that you want, you don't have the job you want, you don't have the relationship you want, you don't, want, you don't have the money that you want, and things just aren't going out the way that you would like them to go, it's all based on your identity and the feeling states of those things that you have in your life that you have memorized and impressed into the subconscious. So the majority of the feeling states that you have memorized are negative. They are not the feeling state of you being the person that you want to be or having the things that you want to have. So what I'm going to do in this video is teach you how to change those memories, to transform those negative memories into the memories of the feeling states of having the things that you want to have. So the first thing that I want you to do here is to contemplate the feeling that you would have were you the person that had everything that you desire. So you can get as specific as you want with this. So if it's, I want to be making $100,000 a year, I want to be making $500,000 a year or a million a year, 10 million a year, whatever that may be. So contemplate that in your mind, say this to yourself, how would I feel right now or how does it feel right now? that I am making a half a million dollars a year or $100,000 a year, whatever your number is. So then you contemplate on that feeling in the present moment and you really submerge yourself in this feeling. And you do this as much as you possibly can throughout the day and before you go to sleep at night. You wanna to try to memorize, see the, the point of this is to memorize this feeling that you are now this identity or you're now this concept of self of this person that is that has the things that you want. So if you wanna make half a million dollars, how does that feel? And you put yourself into that identity as much as you possibly can because before you started doing this or before you apply this, you are in the concept of self that that is in your current reality, whether that's making 25,000 a year, just not having the things that you want in your life. So you have memorized those feeling states of making 25,000 a year for so long and you're stuck in this pattern of being that concept of self. So in order to take you out of that, Prayer, the art of believing, is to believe you already have something. Pray, believing that you already have that. So you're memorizing these prayers, okay? So these feeling states. And as you repetitively create these new feeling states of you being someone else, you will eventually memorize this new concept of self, this new being that you now are. And the subconscious mind is then going to feel that. It's going to feel this new version of you, and it's kind of like... A hack. You're kind of hacking, you're hacking the subconscious mind with this. So you're using repetition to create this new concept of yourself and you have access to this memory whenever you want. So, and additionally to that, when you start reacting to things throughout the day, you're going to have very quick access, very easy access to this feeling state because you've done it so much. You know what this feeling is of your new concept of yourself that everything's working out for you perfectly. You're making this much money. You have your great relationship. Every, you have the perfect physique, everything's working out for you perfectly, and, and there's no problems in your life. So when there's something that comes up in your world that you're about to react to, you're going to have very quick access to this feeling state and get right back into the feeling because you've now memorized this new feeling state of you being this person where everything's working out for you perfectly. And this is really the secret and the trick and a hack to changing your life completely. And if you, and I promise you, if you try this and you actually do this, even for a few days or a few weeks or a few months, at the very most, you're gonna see huge changes. I've even witnessed this happening within an hour, just doing this one time, just creating this feeling, so just contemplating on the feeling that this has already happened to you. Like really just being delusional in the present moment and this is this already happened to me. And just imagine asking yourself a question, asking yourself this serious question, how do I feel now that this has already happened? Or how would I feel if I already had this? And you, tr and you just memorize that feeling. And sometimes it doesn't even take that long, but so in some cases it may, 
depending on where your concept of self is now and how many other feeling states of lack that you have memorized. It's about reprogramming the old memories of feeling states into new memories of feeling states, but but abundant feeling states, no longer of these lack feeling states of, of re reacting to your three-dimensional world, but now you're going ahead of the event. Now you're getting into the feeling of your wish fulfilled all the time that everything's working out for you perfectly. But you can get very specific with this. If this is like a business opportunity, you're trying to grow a business or you're trying to make a certain amount of money every single year, how would you feel right now? Even take a moment right now with me in, during this video and just take a second, <clears throat> how would you feel right now if your income tripled? Right now, just how would you feel right now if your income was tripled? Just feel that and what does that feel? Just, just say a couple words in your mind about how does, how does that feel? Tremendous, absolutely amazing. How does that feel? If that were true right now, if it were true right now, how would you truly feel? And that's all you have to, that's how you memorize these feeling states. You memorize these new feeling states and then you just completely transform your concept of self with these new memorized feeling states. And essentially this is what I did when I was in prison. When I spent time in prison, as you know, at first I had a life sentence that I overcame and eventually got out of prison completely. But the time that I did spend in prison, I, this is what I spent my time doing because my mind was an absolute disaster. I didn't have control of the direction of my attention. My concept of self was stuck on lack, of stuck on trauma, stuck on things in the past. My mindset was completely going the wrong direction. And all of the feeling states that I had memorized that was creating my future was all based on on this mindset of these memorized feeling states of lack of trauma of depression all of these things were just combined and it was just i was just this huge mess in my mind so i had to completely redirect my entire concept of self by completely memorizing new feeling states because all of the old feeling states of my concept of self were all memorized of all those negative things okay so i had to reposition my mind develop that my controlled attention well developed controlled attention was the first thing and then i had to redirect my my memorized feeling states i had to redirect these and start and start putting myself into this new concept of myself what would it feel like if I had this? What would it feel like if I had that? You know, like whispering this magical prayer, you know, whispering this magical prayer. Thank you for showing me that this is already solved. Thank you for showing me that this is already solved. All my problems are already solved. Like you're giving it to your higher self. And how does that feel when your higher self is solving all of your problems? Like all of your problems are solved. How does it feel? And that's why that method was so powerful. And thank you for showing me that this issue was already solved because you're giving it away. You're giving it to your higher self to solve it. And you believe that that's going to happen. And you're experiencing that feeling in the present moment that now all of your issues are solved. And that's why it can it can have these it can it can produce these miracles in your life. But essentially, that's how I did it. I memorized new feeling states, constant new feeling states until I just saturated my, my new concept of self with these new memorized feeling states. And now every day that I wake up, it's like Christmas morning. I feel like everything is working out for me perfectly all the time. And I always have access to those feeling states, no matter what's happening. I can always go. I have such quick and easy access to those and I can go right back to them. I never fall out of my concept of self. That's why I was able to get so much success getting out. I haven't even been out of prison for two years. And now I have established, a, you know, a very successful business, a YouTube channel with nearly 300,000 subscribers and just all around happiness and just great things always coming into my life without having me, without me having to do much about it. It's just who I am and I'm attracting these things to me. And it all happened by changing my memorized feeling states. And that's the next part of this is when you change your concept of yourself, you truly change your entire concept of yourself and you memorize all these new feeling states through repetition and doing different things like, you know, whisper this magical prayer or just asking yourself questions or visualization or affirmations in the present moment when you can actually feel them, when you actually feel them, what happens is you don't have to really micromanage your manifestations much anymore. You're going to be aligned with a lot of great things happening to you because 
everything is from within you. The world is you, everything is you pushed out. So everything begins with your inner dialogue. And when you, and when you change all of your memorized feeling states, you are now, your inner dialogue is completely changed. It's now positive. Now it's picturing things ahead of the event of good things happening to you without you having to do anything. It's going to be automatic manifestation. Your inner dialogue is lining up and you have memorized this new way of thinking. You're always thinking ahead now, not backwards in the past, but the future. So now your mindset is now picturing things ahead of the events that are meant for your concept of self because you've memorized this. So the inner dialogue then uses your imagination the inner dialogue, then these pictures in your mind, your imagination creates reality. Your imagination then creates these pictures in the mind automatically. Then the feeling states are associated with that. And then they're impressed into the subconscious. And then you're shifted in the multiverse into that world. And you're constantly shifting to better and better worlds as you continue. So memorizing these feeling states is the key. And you can use any method that you want. It's just repetition and finding what works best for you. Which one, which is it asking questions or is it affirmations? Is it visualization? Is it scripting, writing it down? But it's repetition is key and being in the present moment. And if you're truly in the present moment, when you're capturing and memorizing these feeling states, that's when they're deeply embedded. They're deeply embedded. The more present you are when you're saying them, when you're saying them and when you're feeling them, the more, the, 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 the stronger the imprint is into your memory, your memorized feeling states. So that's why, and present moment awareness is very important as well as it relates to doing this more quickly. Because the more present you are, the more time slows down in the present moment. So if you have an extreme level of present moment awareness in a meditative state, you can actually do like a year of, of an impression or a year of memorizing feeling states within just a few minutes. So right now I want everyone that's watching this video to create a feeling state right now and start doing it. Create a feeling state right now and write out in the comments below. I want everyone to do this. I want everyone to participate and start right now with this feeling state. And as you're writing this comment, whatever it may be that you desire, whether it's how would I feel right now that my income is tripled? My income is tripled right now and I feel like this or whatever it is that you desire. I want you to leave a comment right now below and create this feeling state. Be present as you're typing it. And I want you to participate in this because as you repeat these, as you memorize these new feeling states, it's absolutely going to change your concept of yourself. And this is truly how you change your concept of self. This is how you shift your identity into the person that you want to be and be and shift yourself into the person that has everything that you desire. So start right now. I'm also going to leave a card on the screen to a free sleep meditation that you can listen to at night as you're falling asleep. That's also going to assist you in memorizing new feeling states. But I want you to also do this during the day. I want you to manually do this throughout the day and create these feeling states yourself, asking yourself questions, affirming, you know, whispering this magical prayer. Thank you for showing me this is already solved. Whatever creates this feeling state, use it as much as you possibly can. And you're going to see huge shifts start to happen. Don't just give up after doing it a couple times. Continue to do it. Just continue to do it at least five, ten times a day. And I promise you, as you do this, you're going to start seeing big changes in your life. You're going to start feeling better, being happier. Great things start coming into your life. So continue to memorize feeling states. Feeling states shift your identity, change your concept of yourself, create an entirely new version of yourself, and watch all of these great things attract into your life. You will become a magnet for great things to come into your life. All right, that's the end of this video. I love you all. Don't forget to give me one thing you are grateful for. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I love you, and I will see you in the next one.